Total Addressable Market, or TAM for short, is the difference between you making millions of dollars a year online and making a few thousand dollars a year online. So in this video, I wanna talk you through how to work out the total addressable marketplace of your particular niche uh, to see if it's the right niche for you and also to give you some tips on how to go about improving that too. Let's go. Total addressable market or TAM for short, okay? Total addressable market, TAM for short. All that means is um, the total universe of potential buyers for a given product, okay? So clearly the more potential buyers for a given product like toothpaste, pretty much everybody brushes their teeth, okay? And uses toothpaste. So the total addressable market for toothpaste is literally everyone, okay? Versus a gaming chair, not everybody's gonna to wanna to use a gaming chair. There's only a certain amount of people that are interested in a gaming chair. As a result of that, the total addressable market is much, much smaller, okay? That's the premise of it. The larger the marketplace, typically the more competitive it will be because the more money that can be made is available to be made within it because you've got more people in it, more people with their purses and wallets waving money at you, uh, more money to be made, okay? That's the premise of it. So how do you figure out what the total addressable marketplace is so you can work out what your own potential income will be from a product? So when I was doing the doggy oodle food thing, this is exactly what I looked at, the number of oodles that were in uh, Australia, figuring out what would happen if I got X percentage of them, what would that mean for a business? What would that value the business at, more importantly? This is uh, a little bit different to niche, just, just to be clear. Niche is what the thing is in what category you're gonna sell. This is how big the marketplace of that niche is. So it's, it's same, same, but different. Anyway, so. A couple of different ways of working it out for you. This is with Helium 10's uh, tool. Oops. So I'm on gaming chairs. And if I just go to uh, X-Ray, it will tell me here that the total revenue for gaming chairs is just shy of $8 million. Okay. So now I get to see, well, in terms of a monthly revenue, for this particular niche, there's approximately $8 million on amazon.com available per month in the gaming chairs niche to use uh, James's terminology, okay? Which is good to know, it's good to know. The other thing, of course, we know that, especially in America, 51% of all product searches begin on Amazon, but that also means 49% don't those 49%, they start in other places. A big chunk of those searches start on Google. So you should absolutely check Google as well. The way that you do that is you get your Google account, you go into tools and settings, and you wanna go uh, to the keyword planner. When you do that, come into keyword planner, type in what the thing is that you're after. In this instance, it's gaming chairs. And you can see on Google, 550,000 people per month search for the term gaming chair, okay? Now, before you get all excited, what that means is in any given search phrase, the word gaming chair is used 550,000 times. So somebody searches for um, what is the best gaming chair uh, in California? That is one search. Um, how, how, what's the best gaming chair made? That's another search. Okay. So don't think it's going to, that's 550 buyer intent search terms. It isn't just to be super clear, but what it does do is it gives you a market size. Here's the potential marketplace for that particular thing. Okay. 
it's important to, to differentiate those two things. So you can use this, I think, as a proxy for the total addressable market as well. Um, the other thing as well on that is I really believe that after a certain point in your e-commerce journey, you will have great skills and great abilities and great insights into how to launch a product online, okay? And you'll probably be at the point where you can pretty much make anything work. Anything you want to launch, you can launch, okay? And so at that point, the difference between people what make millions and millions of dollars and people that make thousands of dollars is total addressable market. That then becomes the difference, okay? You'll get to a point where you can just launch anything and you've got the skills and the experience to do that. Once you're at that point, then total addressable market is the, is the difference that makes the financial difference to your wealth, if that makes sense. That was a video from my regular Monday question and answer session with the members of the Aussie Online Entrepreneurs. We're a community of two and a half thousand e-commerce directed consumer entrepreneurs uh, right around the world with sales of over $50 million and growing. If you'd like to find out more what we do, check out the link in the description. Also be sure to give this video a thumbs up. Uh, that way I'll know you want more information like this and consider subscribing to my YouTube channel because we post brand new money making information just like this each and every day. With that being said, thanks so much for watching. See you on the next video. Bye.